All right, hello everybody. My name is Trey Harrison Chris, and today I'm going to be talking about AMD Vega and why AMD is trying to push away from cryptocurrency miners. Uh, what's currently popular is mining Ethereum, and RX 580s and GTX 1070s have been short on the market, so AMD is trying to do anything they can to get their cards' hands into gamers, which is strange uh, why they would uh, market away from cryptocurrency miners. Somebody who would buy uh, more than one graphics card at a time. Um, like, if you don't know anything about cryptocurrency mining, um, I don't know much about it, but I know that you need uh, a ton of graphics cards. Like, G Google image cryptocurrency mining, you'll see just probably 8 to 10 RX 580s on one platform, and then 8 to 10 RX 580s on the next platform, and they're mining Ethereum, or sometimes you get ASIX gear to like mine bitcoins that's a different kind of story but the thing is amd is coming out with the rx uh, vega 556 and rx vega 64 air cooled yada 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 uh, the radeon aqua pack looks very cool it comes water cooled but um the the way that they're trying to uh, market away from cryptocurrency mining um is by packaging uh two games free uh so when you buy um uh, uh, RX Vega 56 or RX Vega 64, you will get two of these games if you live in Wolfenstein and Prey. All right, if you're if you're a miner and you don't play games, you're like, okay, whatever. I don't care about these games. Please go away. Uh, I just want a graphics card. Just sell me a graphics card. Don't add anything to the price, but a graphics card so I can buy five graphics cards. That's the that's the cryptocurrency mining set. They want as many graphics cards as possible for cheap. So what AMD is doing is packing stuff that gamers are going to be like, yes, free games, oh my god. And cryptocurrency miners are going to be like, god damn it, this is going to add to the price. I don't need any of this stuff. So also, if you buy uh, RX Vega, you get $100 off if you, buy, if you buy select AMD Ryzen 7 CPU and motherboard combo. You get $100 off your Vega if you get a Ryzen CPU as well. More deals, more deals that are going to drive gamers to the product. Hopefully, 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 gamers who can play play on this is is what AMD wants. That's why they're doing all this stuff. But it's strange to me as just from a company standpoint, um, cryptocurrency mining is just a great, great thing if you're a graphics card company. I mean, it's driving your prices up, and you guys don't have anything. You guys are making more money because people are buying more graphics cards, and you guys are trying to limit that. It doesn't totally make sense as, like, a capitalistic company. You should just be trying to sell as many graphics cards as possible and not care if they're going to gamers or cryptocurrency miners or whatever. Um, but this is this is their way of uh, marketing this. But we're not done. We're not done. Plus, get $200 off if you buy a Samsung 34-inch ultra-wide HD curved monitor with quantum dot and Radeon FreeSync technology. They're adding in a monitor into this combo. You don't have to buy uh, an RX Vega with all this stuff, but if you are going to get some of this stuff, they're saying you get all this discount, 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 discount. So AMD strategy here is they think that this deal is going to drive in way more gamers to this product um, than just the, the prices for the cards alone uh, up here. But yeah, these are, these are all the packs. These are with the, the special pack. They, I think they actually are packed all together. I think that it all just comes with this, but I'm not sure. Yeah, because it doesn't. It says plus special offer, plus special offers, plus special offer. Um, another thing I wanted to show you guys was where is this? Do I still have that? Um, this. So AMD, uh, this PC Gamer article. Um, the reason it, uh, RX Vega had so many leaks and everyone thought it was going to launch for like months, months before it actually launched, is because of this ETH. Ethereum miners, um, there's such a high demand for GPUs, and they didn't want to uh, launch their product with not enough GPUs that all the miners are going to come in and grab all the cards super quick. So they have been making a ton of cards, a ton of cards. And so one thing, if you are an Ethereum miner, um, there was one quote in this. All right, here we go. Um, I'm going to read this part. Part of the reason it's taken us uh, a little longer to launch Vega, and I'll be honest about the about that it's that we wanted to make sure we were launching with good volume obviously we've got to compensate for things like coin miners they are going to want to get their hands on these hook said hook explained he literally said that 
cryptocurrency miners are going to love this card. So if you're if you're a cryptocurrency miner, if you are into mining Ethereum or whatever, uh, I know they're trying to not get these hands into these cards into your guys' hands, but <laughs> this guy from AM from AMD, uh, Chris Chris Hook from AMD, is literally saying that they are definitely going to want to get their hands on this. So leave a like, leave a dislike. Let me know if you thought this story was interesting. Um, let me know if you guys want me to do anything uh, more about the AMD Vega launch, or if you guys are more interested about cryptocurrency, I can kind of research up and do some stuff about that. I know a lot of my GTX 1070 videos are only popular, literally only popular in this last month uh, because of the cryptocurrency mining, because uh, of all the Ethereum. People love GTX 1070s. And I think my SLI uh, benchmarks, people were drawn to those just to see performance, stuff like that. So if you see random GTX 1070 benchmarks on my channel, feel free to not watch it. Leave a like. I'm just trying to um, build up my channel, get as many different topics, different people um, in the channel. So the comment section is amazing. Um, it's always good to have different types of people, different thoughts um, in the comment section so I can see what you guys are thinking, see what you guys want me to do in the future. Besides that, leave a like, leave a dislike, do whatever you want. My name is Trey Harrison Chris, and I'm out of here!